welcome back to my channel CA made with logic so in this video we will be going to discuss account strategy for May 23 examination and henceforth so uh, the entire portion I have divided into 60 percentage and 30 percentage and 10 percentage category uh, so why I have divided into these three parts because as per the difficulties level and as per the amount of time investment uh, I have divided into these three parts First, let, let, let us discuss this 10 percentage category, which is very easy because since if you see in this, the important thing is you have to remember the formats, nothing else you to consume less amount of time. And if you are able to remember the pro proper formats properly, you can able to uh, perform well in your examination. First comes the insurance claim chapter. There are only two concepts in this chapter. If you see loss of profit and loss of uh, stock, one is in loss of profit, you have to remember the eight steps, nothing else. Okay. If you are able to remember these eight steps properly, 99% of your answer is going to be correct for sure. Okay. And in loss of stock, there is one sum related to normal and abnormal losses please go through that some particularly and then comes a uh, profit prior incorporation in this chapter the only difficult thing which students find is one is uh, finding sales ratio and time ratio if you are able to find out sales ratio and time ratio correctly you will be going to perform well in your uh, exam okay so then uh, simple chart okay so that you can able to remember uh, the things okay which which are under all uh, you have to treat it pre incorporation which are all expense you have to treat it post incorporation so if you want this uh, pdf you can uh, it will be available in the description box or else you can join this uh, telegram channel and uh, ca made with logic and you you will get the pdf then comes uh, bonus and right issue in this chapter the only uh, thing you have to focus on is uh, wherever the journal entry related sum is being given whether in study material whether in RTP or whether in MTP please go through that sum it is very important I am pretty sure that journal entry sum is going to hit in this uh, particular chapter and in uh, and even in May 23 uh, RTP they have given one sum related to journal entry only so please focus on this and then comes a financial statement which is nothing but schedule 3 format which is easy since we have already uh, uh, learned it many times during our school days itself and there is one change in the balance sheet okay so please go through that format as well and moreover if you see another two concept when is, uh, one is managerial remuneration another one is capital related okay so you can find out uh, two to three sums in your uh, uh, study material also and you can go through that sums that is well sufficient so this 10 percentage category chapters consist nearly comes for 20 to 25 marks and it requires less amount of effort since there is only a proper format if you are able to remember the proper format you will going to perform well in your examination this is the simple logic behind this 10 percentage category that's why i have kept it 10 percentage category and i have uh, given one time revision only if, we, if they are able to see it one time all these th three chapters they will going to perform well in their examination if you same thing uh, we have divided this 30 percentage as well in uh, department accounts uh, uh, go through this rtp uh, 23 uh, sum okay and in single single entry you have to go through it uh, you have to remember all the how to open all the formats of single entry like how to open a format of debtors account what are all items are there okay uh, how to open account of the creditors account okay bills payable bills receivable all these accounts you have to properly able to open it so that uh, your answer gets correct most probably okay then comes redemption of preference shares and debenture in redemption of preference share only journal entry related some please go through that okay nothing else you need to go through okay and in redemption of debenture all uh, uh, you have to open uh, own debenture account then 10 percentage debenture account all the format related sum you go through it once and journal entry sum is also very important in debenture okay redemption of debenture then comes uh, accounting standard uh, which is very important which has a highly weightage okay it nearly comes for 20 to 25 marks in the exam paper okay so there are only total seven accounting standard in that all uh, four different uh, accounting standard will be going to seen in the exam paper so please go through that properly so that you perform well in your examination then comes branch accounts branch accounts uh, sure short question is going to come i have written it sure short 
that means it is going to be seen in your May 23 exam paper at any cost. Okay, in that also I can specifically say that foreign operation related sums is very 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 important since the past three attempts they haven't tested this concept and in may 23 rtp they have given up uh, one sum related to foreign operation so please go through that sum particularly okay then comes higher purchase higher purchase and investment uh, any one will be going to be tested okay so sure short sure, these two chapters are also very important and even in rtp uh, both the both the concepts have been tested so please go through it okay then comes uh, let's discuss important accounting standard uh, as number 3 is very important since if you see in november 22 exam paper they have tested it for theory okay but they have they haven't tested it for practical so this time i am expecting both the methods like direct methods and indirect method both you have to solve uh, from the given question okay so you if you want to see uh, these type of sums you can just go through may 19 exam paper since it was being tested in the may 19 exam paper the same sum you have to solve from the both the methods direct and indirect method so sure short sure, this question is going to come please be caution about it and as number 16 and 12 these are another very 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 important be ready to see in the exam paper okay then one question can be tested from a uh, framework chapter this is what i am expecting uh, one is going going concern related sum you have to go through it and another theory is uh, user qualitative elements financial statements uh, financial uh, asserts assumptions you have to see 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 it okay then comes accounting standard one and two from these one and two any one will be going to be tested from 16 and 12 i am expecting both the accounting standard since i have written uh, either both of them will be going to be tested or uh, any one will going to be tested but uh, as per my analysis and opinion both will going to be seen in the exam paper so please be prepared accordingly okay then if you have any other doubts you can join our telegram channel ca made with logic and all in one ca test series also you can join where uh, 2.9 actually uh, i haven't updated here 2.9 k that is 2900 people are being connected from all over india so if you want to buy our important question answer list for may 23 examination so definitely you can contact us in this number and past four attempt feedbacks is also uh, taken from our students okay they have all they have taken the benefit of important list and they have performed well in their examination so if you want to see that we will make it available in the description box so that you can go through it once and we you will get an idea whether you should uh, pursue this list or not okay how trustworthy it is okay so thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it do comment and let me know uh, what next strategy what next subject strategy you are looking for in this channel so do comment and let me know if you really enjoyed this video please do share with your friends and do like and do subscribe my channel thank you for watching the video